Hello everyone, today I'm gonna show you how to blur your screen just in case something happens. Disclaimer, this does not save you from bans. Uh, if Twitch sees titties on your stream, you will get banned either way. First off, you need to download this plugin down here that I will also link in the description for you. It's called Stream Effects. It has multiple plugins. One of them is Blur, which we will use right now. First off, you will need your game or any source that you want to blur. And then you will add group. Let's just name it Blur Group, which you want to copy and then paste reference, put it inside the folder. So there's like, there's two of them now. Or you can also use Source Mirror. Let's just name it Blur Source. And then you can mirror your media source in there. I recommend using, they're, they're probably the same. I don't really recommend anything. You can use whatever you want. But for simplicity, we'll just use source mirror. Now, right click on your source mirror, go to filters, press the plus sign and go to blur. On the type, Choose dual filtering. I think dual filtering is the last laggy out of all the types. And then subtype is area, size. You can go between two to five, depending on how much you want it blurred. Let's go with five for now. So now you have something that blurs everything. Now, how do we make this usable while we're playing? Is that you go to settings, go to hotkeys, go to the scene you want to use it on, and you will see show blur source. You will put in a hotkey for that. For simplicity's sake, we'll use up and then hide on down and click apply. So whenever you're playing a game and then you suddenly see something that's not safe or you just want to preemptively blur in case something happens, you can just press your hotkey and then it blurs it for you. And then you can just disable it if it's safe. Thank you for watching.